Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Welcome back to the channel, you guys. Um, we are going to continue our Declutter My Life series. And we have to do Mia's toys again because obviously, you know, she got a lot of toys for Christmas. And I did clean up, go through some of them beforehand, before Christmas, but it wasn't a lot. And as you can see, like, the bins are completely overflowing. So I have to get this mess organized or at least somewhat organized so it's not so chaotic so welcome to cassie's chaos i got my iced coffee mia's going to play uh, while i organize and also play with her and i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like share leave me some comments subscribe and always hit the notification bell so you're always notified when i upload new content on my channel and speaking of channels, um, I have created a family vlogging channel on YouTube. It is called um, Meet the Gibsons underscore. So if you guys are into vlogs and stuff like that, I'm going to start posting the vlogs on that channel. There's nothing on that channel right now except for, I think, maybe one short. Um, but if you guys are into, like, vlogs... I'm going to start posting vlogs there. It's just chaotic right now. Um, my husband is working in some races right now. So he's been very busy. We haven't seen much of him. Um, he's mostly just here to sleep most of the time <laughs> for a couple of weeks anyway. Um, just a lot of stuff going on behind the scenes. So I haven't posted anything over there yet but i'm going to be posting there soon it's probably going to be a disney video going to disney something like that um so i hope you guys will check us out and support us over there and let's get glowing I don't know if you guys can see it, but don't you just love my two mismatched socks? It's great. <laughs> So basically all I'm doing is going through the bins and taking out stuff that she does not play with or that's broken or that shouldn't be in the bins and I'm putting it in a bag and then the bag goes into the garage and then I decide if I'm going to donate it or like if it's mostly trash which this one was mostly trash like there was broken toys a couple of weird glad container lids that were chewed up from the dog um old stickers old broken puzzle pieces like it was a lot it was mostly a lot of trash so this bag is probably going to end up going in the trash but i'm basically trying to just organize the bins so it's not so chaotic um and this is not all of her toys she also has about i think four bins inside her bedroom closet like she has way too many toys and that's why I wanted to do this to try to lower the amount of stuff. But it ended up being mostly tr like broken stuff and trash that I put in the bags. Um, She has a lot of stuffed animals. So those took up two bins. But the stuffed animals is something that I always refuse to get rid of because a lot of it was either mine as a baby or um, just stuff that's very sentimental, like her first Christmas bear, her first ever teddy bear, her Disney stuff that we spent a lot of money on at Disney World. That stuff, like I will never get rid of any of that stuff. So 
Even though she doesn't necessarily play with the stuffed animals, I like to keep them around. I'm not sure if I said it already, but that cute little tall dollhouse in the background, we got that at a thrift shop for $12. It's vintage, and um, the only thing that was wrong with it is it had a screw missing. So the top, like the top the first floor or third floor or whatever you want to call it, was a little loose, but we just screwed a screw in it, and now it's fine. Um, it had some it had some stickers all over it, but that's fine because Mia loves stickers. Um, but yeah, we got it's vintage and we got it at the thrift store for like twelve dollars. And these things go for like hundreds of dollars. So I was super super excited about that find, and it's super cute. And Mia absolutely loves it. She literally plays with it every single day. Of course, there is Dolly Rose in the background trying to tear up the toys per usual. She has torn up so many toys, but it's I've explained to Mia that it's technically her fault because she keeps her toys out all over the floor where the dog can get them. So if you're going to be messy and not clean up your toys, the, that's what happens. So she's kind of starting to understand. As you can see, she picked up something that Dolly was trying to get. And she put it away on the table so Dolly couldn't get it. Um, so she's learning. She's learning to finally pick up her own toys. Because she knows that if she doesn't, the dog is going to tear them up. And it will technically be her fault for leaving them in the floor.
of one bag of stuff that she doesn't play with. I put the stuffed animals into two separate containers, which she has a lot of. And yeah, so at least the chaos is a little bit more in order. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this quick video, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys, and always remember, don't forget to glow today. Okay.